does it have the romance of France? Paris? Let's find out. There are 14 across the country. Ramey Winchester is the assistant executive director of the Chamber of Commerce. She truly believes Paris, Tennessee is the most Parisian of all. Because it has a Parisian motel? Well, it's American owned. Because settlers found something French about it? None whatsoever. No, I'm sure there wasn't. I've never heard of it in, in, in any form, no. Because of French cuisine. Chicken and dumplings, apple dumplings, all of our desserts, usually a special casserole. Can I get any French bread here? No. No French bread? We don't make French bread. So, we opened a guidebook. The closest thing to the Ark was an American trademark. I like their fries. Yes, do have French fries. <laughs> oh, France, yes. Paris, France, <laughs> yeah. Is there anything Paris about Paris, Tennessee? Is there anything Paris? Well, we have an Eiffel Tower. Uh, 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 what? Or an Eiffel Tower. Reproduction an of Eiffel the Eiffel Tower? Eiffel Tower. <laughs> It's 65 feet tall. It's made from over 500 uh, Douglas fir trees and 6,000 steel rods. Whereas the one in Paris, France, I don't know how high it is. I've been up on it. It's way, way high. But why does Winchester think Paris, Tennessee is the most French? Well, Paris, Texas had an Eiffel Tower with a 10-gallon hat on the top of it, and it blew over. So I would like to say that probably Paris, Tennessee is the most Parisian. So there is one pigeon in this Paris. Once in a while, a blue plate special that's French. Quiche. 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 All right, quiche. quiche will work. But it's this that makes this Paris most Parisian, even though few people here know what to call it. It's the tower. It's a, the, um, in something tower. Stuart Maddox, News 2 at 5.